what is the volume of the solid below? Now, in order to find the volume, we have to break this up into two different pieces and then find missing links. I'm going to cut this right here. Now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to start by finding the volume of this top part right here. I know that it has a width of 1 and it has a height of 7. The length is what we're looking for from left to right. As you could see, this is a rectilinear figure, so it shares the same length here. Our length is 8. So the volume of this section is 8 times 1 times 7, or 8 times 7, which is equal to 56 millimeters cubed. That's the top part. Now we have to find the volume of this bottom section. I see we have a width of 6, a length of 8, and our height is what is missing. Now I know that the height from the very top all the way down is 9. And we already, if you look on the other side, the length from here on up is 7. So 2 plus 7 would equal the total of 9. That has a height of 2. Now when we multiply this, we do 8 times 6 times 2, which is 48 times 2, or 96 millimeters cubed. Now in order to find the volume of the total shape, we have to take 56 from the top and add in 96 from the bottom section to find out that it is a total of 152 millimeters cubed. That's a lot of work, but a great answer.